Thank you. My question is for Lynn. Lynn, you have said that you hate politics and you've thrown accusations on both sides of the aisle. With only over 55% of the seven district being minority, many of them first and second generation immigrants, how are you going to connect with those voters and work for them to represent them in Washington? Thank you, Lisa. Uh, one of the things that when we've been out on the campaign trail, I've talked to hundreds of voters myself and has talked to thousands and thousands, tens of thousands of voters. Number one at the top of their list is immigration. This is a very, very important issue for the seventh district. We have so many of our residents that have immigrated. So many of those residents are also looking forward to bringing their other family members over. I think that we have to, we Republicans have to take a strong stand on making sure that people get in line, that we enforce legislation that makes people get in line and follow the process that exists. This is very, very important. 15 seconds. We Republicans, we Republicans must stand together and let the 7th District know that as a party, as a nation, we are, we love our immigrants. All right, and you have the option for a 30 second response if you'd like. I think it's important that we do get in line, but getting someone to trust you is an important part of communicating that process. And I hope that that's something you will continue to work towards throughout this campaign.